Our first guest tonight is an Emmy and Tony-nominated actor you know from the hit series Stranger Things and movies like Black Widow and Violet Knight. He stars in We Have a Ghost, which premieres February 24th on Netflix. Please welcome back to the show our friend David Harbour, everybody. What a crowd. We're always, we're always so happy you're here. What a crowd. Thank you and for you having me. Here, we were talking backstage. You were here for when we were in the studio and no crowds. So yeah, I know. Nice. That was uh, dark times. Yeah, it was dark times. Just like five producers enthusiastically clapping like yeah. a child's ballet recital. It was like a child. Like, oh, my God, you're doing yeah. so great. Yeah. I will say, after those 12 months, I'm like, I'm a very fancy boy. <laughs> I fell for it. I fell, they convinced me. Um, you're, you're not wrong. No, thank you very much. I want to start with something. I'm just going to get it out of the way. Um, you and your wife, the incredibly talented Lily Allen, you gave a tour to Arch Architectural Digest <laughs> of your home, and um, it became a lot of, it, it sort of entered the discourse. People wanted <laughs> to talk about your apartment, including the fact that you have a carpeted bathroom. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, listen so, to the groaning yeah. already. We're going to talk about this. Okay. So what was this, a, was this a couple's decision? Did you both feel strongly about a carpeted bathroom? No. Okay. I made very few decisions in okay, this house. Okay, gotcha. But I how do you feel about make... it so far? Look, I like it. <laughs> there's, a, there's a romance to a carpeted bathroom. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? Because you feel like... like... Well, like you're in Paris in the 20s. And yeah, you're like before they like smoke... invented tiles. Exactly. <laughs> Smoking jetons and, yeah. and inhaling black mold. Yeah. Oh, right. This is an era before people knew that was a bad thing. Yeah. There was Where they a... would just like squish out of the tub and just leave. Yeah, you just roll out, get those wet feet all <laughs> over there for years and years and just whatever accumulates. Accum I like terrariums. Yeah. Because you know? it did seem like social media um, fell uh, like very uh, hardly on the side of this is not okay. <laughs> I think everybody's become such a nerd after COVID. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. We're so uh, they it's forget such squares. It's like whatever, a little bit of, you know, molds. Yeah. <laughs> not Some might argue it fights the COVID, right? Like if you have enough, <laughs> like COVID looks at a house like this and is like, no, thank you. <laughs> Wait, we, we pulled some tweets. You have not seen these tweets yet. I have not seen we, we, these. These oh are a few. God. All right, here you go. Do you want to just read it for so, us? Yeah, yeah. Right. Uh, I'm sorry. I just watched the David Harbour slash Lily Allen AD house tour. Carpet in the bathroom should be a cancelable offense. <laughs> I do like the, these. I guess that's bad for the promotion of my movie. Yeah, that's... Uh, from Prill, what the f do Lily Allen and David Harbour have a carpeted bathroom? Why? Why the f Yeah. And then this is nice because this is obviously a fan of yours. Not even David Harbour can make me feel good about <laughs> carpet in the bathroom. I don't know. I like it. I like everything about it. Now, you referred to this... Keeping this one. Okay, good. You referred to this as a space fridge. Yeah, we got to talk about this. Okay, so you called it a space fridge, and then people got even angrier, because then they were like, you got a fridge in your bathroom? It's not a fridge. Okay. It's not an actual fridge. Okay. It just looks like a fridge from space. Got it. Like, so one, like a NASA so fridge. So it's like a cabinet. It's a cabinet where you put, like, lotions in and gotcha. things like that. Yeah, but you guys like... wanted to, in that, like, sort of, that same sort of uh, theme of romance, you wanted to feel like a fridge was in your bathroom. Like a fridge from outer space. Yeah. Like romance, you, you know, like romance. You were both like in 1920s yeah. France and way in the future. Exactly. <laughs> it's like Star Wars. Yeah, A yeah. long, long time ago oh, in right. a galaxy so, far away. Yeah, so far, that far back. Right, we they, carpet bathrooms and we, we keep have our fridge. products in a space fridge. You know what, you guys. You get us. I get you I so much. I love it. Now, I want to ask if your kids get you. They're at the age where they're opinionated. You were telling me backstage, yeah. 10 and 11. Yeah. What do they think about the design? They've described it as, uh, they said, Mommy, we live in a clown house. Oh. <laughs> it's yeah. not that bad. <laughs> I mean, there's got to be places for clowns yeah. in this world. Right, you can't just expect them to all live in a car. <laughs> <laughs> now, yeah, they don't like that. Are, uh, are you strict with the kids? I mean, 
I go through phases. Uh -huh. I'm getting, it's getting harder, I think, that they're getting smarter and sure. older. It's easier to be strict uh, when they're younger and sort of dumber. I had a, <laughs> this was, I, I had an experience where it was during the pandemic, one of them had thrown out a piece of paper that was really important. It was some kind of something, I don't know, but it was the whole day we spent looking for this piece of paper. And finally we found it in the trash can and one of them had thrown it out and neither of them would fess up to it. And we were furious. And I said, uh, I am gonna find out uh, who threw this thing out. And I brought in a dish of um, flour <laughs> and I had them dip their fingers in it. And I just went away, silent, I just I went away. Put it down, I came back and I said, listen, uh, I know how to fingerprint people <laughs> because I've done a lot of cop shows. <laughs> and it's true. What I didn't realize at the time was that you're supposed to actually put their fingers in ink. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you did some of the lesser cop <laughs> you're shows. Supposed to, you're supposed to dust for the print. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't do that. You did it backwards, yeah. I did it backwards. <laughs> but they still believe me. I left and I came back with a little piece of paper. And I said, uh, I have the results of the fingerprinting. <laughs> so if you'd like to tell me now who actually did it, it'll be easier for you. Wow. Yeah. Did it work? It worked. Like wow. It worked. Yeah. They immediately fessed up. That is Thank a you. Fun. There you go. Thank you. You won them back after the old carpet in the bathroom. I, exactly. <laughs> Once they get to be like 11, though, they, they just think you're an idiot for yeah. doing things like that, which you are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's still, and we'd be, and we're trying to get an 11-year-old to put your fingers in flour. Good luck. I mean, <laughs> get out of here, old man. <laughs> they just blow it back. I've your done face. a lot of cop shows. <laughs> Uh, I want to ask about your new movie. We'll be right back with more from David Arbor. <laughs>